Hi guys, this is John from Design Wall, and today, how to set up a new primary menu. First, you go to Appearance, and then Menus, and then we enter the menu's name. Let's use Primary Menu, and then we click the Create Menu button. Now, we need to make sure our Primary Menu checked box is checked, or else it's not going to appear at all in the front end. And if you want, you can now delete items that you don't want displayed on the menu. For now, we're going to take out the blog, the sample page, and the typography page. Now let's jump to the left-hand column and select the Categories tab. And let's choose View All, and then just unselect any category that we don't want to show. Blogs and Uncategorized. And then we click Add to Menu. And look, just like that, we have a menu loaded with all of our categories. Now, for those menu items that we want to appear as a submenu item, all you need to do is just drag them just a bit to the right. Now, if we want to create a menu without a link, simply type a hashtag in the URL field and then give it a name. We'll call this one Features, and click Add to Menu. And now we can add submenu items to Features. So let's go back in to the Pages, and we're going to add back in Blog, Sample Page, and Typography Pages, all subpages of Features. Now, what if you want to reorder the menu? All we need to do is simply drag and drop our menu items in the order that we want them to appear. And after we're through, don't forget to Save Menu. Oh, and one more thing. You can also go to Screen Options to find many other options to customize the menu. You'll find all sorts of choices here. All right, the moment of truth. Let's head back out front and see what it looks like. And here is our menu with our main categories and beneath each, great looking subcategories. And remember the features menu item that we set up with no link? Hey, well done. Thanks for watching.